the backpack tax. Molly stared and stared at the amazing pink backpack. It had the delightful design of an elephant on the back. It had the big gray ears that stuck out on the sides and the long trunk that hung from its face. Elephants were Molly's favorite animals in the whole wide world. Every Saturday afternoon, Molly and her parents went together to the shopping mall to watch a movie at the th theater. After the movie, Molly would ask her parents for permission to a drop by the toy store. Once inside, she would rush to the elephant backpack to the stroke its plush, fluffy ears, and pull its long trunk. Trunk. Each Saturday morning, Molly's mother paid her an allowance for completing her chores, five dollars. Afterward, Molly would total up the money. She have saved in her elephant-shaped piggy bank. Did she have enough to enough to buy the backpack yet? The elephant backpack cost thirty dollars one week. Molly counted fifteen dollars in her bank. The next week she counted twenty dollars, and the next twenty-five dollars, and then one beautiful Saturday. The counted again. She had thirty dollars. Molly sang with a delightedly and danced around her room. I'm going to buy the backpack. That afternoon, her family went to watch another movie at the shopping mall. The movie was hilarious, hilarious. But Molly barely even noticed. Once the movie had ended, Molly marched straight to the toy store. Molly carefully took the elephant backpack from the rack. Her mom asked, "How much does it cost?" Molly, Molly said, "The tag says thirty dollars, and that's exactly how much money I have." But Molly, you also have to pay sales tax on the top of the price. Said Mom, the sales tax is six cents for every dollar something costs. That means you need thirty-one dollars and eighty cents to purchase purchase the backpack. What? That's not fair! Cried Molly. What's a sales tax? Every time we buy something, we pay a little bit extra for the sales tax. That explains. But why do I have to pay a tax? Asked the money. I'm just a kid. Tax pay for things that help the people who live in the community. Said the mom. Let's put the backpack back on the shelf, and I'll explain it on the way home. They walked outside to the crowded parking lot and got into the car. Mom asked, "Do you remember how we got to the mall today? We drove here in this car." Said Molly. "That's right," said Mom. "And what is the car driving on?" A road. Molly asked. Exactly. Said Mom, we use roads every day, but the roads are very expensive to build. How much money do you do you think a road costs? Molly thought for a moment. She looked at the road as it went by. A thousand dollars, she guesses. That's a lot of money. Mom agreed, but the roads costs cost even more than that. The roads cost a million of dollars to build. Molly gasped. "Do you have millions of dollars?" Mom asked. "No way," Molly said. "Neither do I. Do I love the mom? Most people don't have enough money to build a road on their own. But if everyone pay a little extra money for the text," said Dad, "we can build a new road together." 
So we pay the tax. When we buy things, Molly asked. Yes, there's one kind of tax, a sales tax. We also pay a tax because we own our house. So that that's called a pro property tax, and I get paid a salary for doing my job. Said Mom. The government takes some taxes out of every paycheck I receive. That's called an income tax. That's a lot of taxes. Molly said, "Do all those taxes build roads? Taxes pay for roads and lots of other things." Dad said, "Look out the window. Taxes pay for that park and its swimming pool. Taxes pay for the library、uh, over there." Mom said, pointing. Taxes pay for the town to pay police officers. And the firefighters, and guess what? Taxes even pay for you to go to school. Really? Exclaimed Molly. Yes, taxes pay for the school building and the book you use, and your teacher's salary. Said Dad. Of course, that doesn't mean that everyone wants to pay them. What do you mean? As Molly, people don't always agree on not how much money we should pay in taxes. Mom said they also have different idea about how the money collected from taxes should be spent. At home, Molly changed into her pajamas and climbed into into bed. She thought about the elephant backpack again. So my backpack costs thirty dollars plus tax. She asked. That's right, Molly said. The tax is one dollar and eighty cents. You do you have thirty one dollars and eighty cents? No, said Molly. But the next week I have thirty five dollars. Will that be enough? Yes, it will, Mom said. You said that the tax will take your weight another, another week to gather your backpack a little bit. Molly nodded, but maybe my tax money will help build to build a park.